Hello guys, welcome you all to my YouTube channel. Guys, in this video, I'm going to keep you aware about Google new policy changes. Suppose guys, if you have a Google Play console account, definitely you need to aware about these policies. Because you know what guys, I lost my Google Play console account. My account is basically permanently get closed by Google because of policy changes and because of my careless and inactive my account for a while without publishing or giving any updates to my existing published application. Why we need this Google Play Console? The reason is if you are developing a mobile application, you definitely need this Google Play Console account to publish your application or mobile application publicly. The people can download from the uh, Play Store, right? So this is the reason why you need this Google Play console. It is not free. You need to pay $25 to uh, purchase that account. It is a lifetime payment. So you don't need to pay after uh, paying $25 again. But if you are developing for uh, iOS, you definitely need to purchase Apple uh, developer console that will definitely you need to pay annually, right? But anyway, uh, don't go to uh, that sector. So you know what guys, uh, in 2020, uh, I had an interest on uh, developing a mobile application. So due to this reason, uh, I have purchased this uh, Google Play Console. I think uh, I purchased this for a $25, yes, $25. So right now, I'm still thinking it is $25. If no, please uh, put it on below comment section. Then at least uh, other people know about these changes. You know what guys, I have developed uh, one of the applications, uh, mobile application for busy parent. That is what my first mobile application is. So I have published on uh, Google Play Console. So anyway, if you are publishing your first application, it will taking a time because they're reviewing all the things and that after that they will give you approval, right? Then only your application will available on Play Store. Overall, I have developed two kind of applications and both two are basically published on uh, Play Store, right? You know that uh, after publishing, you need to maintain your application, but I didn't do that uh, because I didn't get a chance because after that, when I was see the stat of the download, I see people are not uh, installing or downloading the application. So the first application is basically that developed for busy parents. That uh, download stat I saw that 100 plus people download, but application is not become a very famous. So due to this reason, I didn't give any updates in that application. When we face the economic crisis, I have developed another application that is uh, food ordering. In the economic crisis, I start a small business, uh, startup business that is basically uh, a wingy special. The name called wingy special. It's a mango flavor kind of a food. Right, so spicy food. It's a kind of a spicy food. If you purchase our wingy special, uh, that is a one QR code and all. You can uh, scan and you can uh, win the uh, recharge. Uh, that is that's the kind of uh, applications I have developed. So that's also published in Google Play Console and uh, it is available publicly uh, on Play Store as well at that time. After that, I didn't publish any kind of applications and I didn't give any updates to existing applications so basically it is become inactivated after that uh, recently policy got changed normally you know that if you have a, a google account or play console account you need to aware about their policy changes each and every month or each and every years they uh, introducing a couple of new policies. due to these new policies some of the things will get uh, effect and some of the things will not getting effect so we you need to keep aware about the google policy things right this is happened because uh, i didn't notice this mails because i have a uh, two email accounts and one i always uh, using a primary one secondary is very less normally not uh, going through that uh, secondary account uh, so but uh, i'm keep i'm always active on this uh, primary account but the thing is uh, because of my careless i lose 25 dollar account suppose if you have a google developer account to keep remember you need to always you need to publish a new application or you need to give uh, updates to your existing application. So basically somehow you need to keep active in your Google Play console account. If it is not happen, what happen is uh, your account get closed. One of the warning is uh, came to my email that saying your developer account is at risk being closed because it is not being used. So they send us the warning mail before the seven days. So they are asking to uh, publish or uh, maintain or give updates to existing applications. Somehow you need to make it active your account, then your account will be uh, not getting close. So, but, but I didn't show this mail because 
uh, I already told you this is my secondary account. I am not going through always, right? So because of my careless, this is happened. This is happening on March 9, 2024. And after that, the final mail got 2024, March 21st. What they're saying is, hello, Play Console developer. Your developer account, Rahim, has been closed because it was not being used. To protect the uh, the safest app user, developer account are not active, active, actively publishing or maintaining app are closed. The developer account registration fees is not refundable. For more information about the policy, you need to visit the this, this center. So, and also guys, another thing is guys, uh, your money is not refundable. As per the new policy, suppose your account get closed, they will not refund your money back because that's how the new policy is. So guys, suppose if you have a Play Console account, keep in mind, don't uh, keep your account inactive, right? So at least publish uh, some applications or at least uh, give updates or maintain your existing applications or somehow you need to keep your account active then only your account will not get closed otherwise what happen is your account getting closed so this is my uh, google play console you can see i can't access any kind of uh, links because the account is closed right so in the policy status you can able to see the summary of the thing summary the status is basically account closed right so when it is closed is March 21st, 2024. The warning message they send is uh, January uh, 70, and warning deadline is basically March 70, right? So they sending repeat and repeat those mails, but because of my careless, I lose this account. Anyway, that's okay, fine, because we all are human, we doing our mistakes, and we are learning from our mistakes, right? That's how it is. But yes, of course, Keep always eye on your email account and the emails which is uh, sending by Google and always aware about the policies. Right guys, suppose if you are inactive for a while, keep count activate to mitigate or prevent from this account closing. That's the reason I created this video because you know what, uh, imagine if you publish couple of applications, let's say my case that is fine because I only published two applications. But suppose if you guys are mobile app developers, sometimes you will publish many kind of applications, variety of applications. So in this case, something is happened, this is can't recoverable. So that's the reason I'm uh, creating this video. At least you guys need to aware about these new policy changes. So the new policy change is you need to maintain your application existing applications or somehow you need to keep active your account if not the account getting closed and your money is not refundable so that's the reason i'm creating this video at least you guys right now know about these policy changes guys i have a small request to all of you if you are not yet subscribed my channel go below and hit the subscribe button if you like our video hit the thumbs up button and also don't forget to hit the bell button if you do only once i upload a new video you will get notified then guys, have a great day. I will catch you on new video. Bye.